Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Welcome, Sonia Beth. <laughs> How are you? I'm tired, but good. Okay, nice. You're early in the class. Congratulations. Nice. Yeah, thank you. Okay. For okay. first time. <laughs> okay, nice. Good. So we're going to start uh, sharing the presentation, right? Later, I will take the attendance. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to English for Work program. Uh, this is Intermediate 3. Today, we're going to learn about how to avoid, how to say no to double negative, right? And this is the date of July 26th, right? That's it, right? And we're going to start before everything with the discussion topic. And this is the discussion topic, right? Yesterday, courtesy of Ana Maria, right? She said that she wanted to talk about this topic. So we're going to talk about this topic. And this is the first question. Just give me a second, give me a second. The first question is, well, the topic is annoying things, right? Means in Spanish, las cosas que me molestan, right? Things that I don't like, or that bothers me, right? And here we have the first question. Do you think you have habits that annoy, que molestan, right? Que incomoda, right? Annoy other people? So what do you think? Uh, okay. So Sonia Ved, what do you think? Hello, hello. Okay, so let me see. Um, can you hear me, Sonia, Sonia Bet? Here I have the participant. Well, let me see. Mariano, hello, Mariano. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? Ana Maria. Hello, hello, sorry, here I am. Hi, everybody. Mariano, hello. Can you hear me? Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Ah, 
I had some problem with my internet tonight. I don't know what happened. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, Hello. Hello. I'm here. Hi. Hello. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? Hello, hello. Can you hello. hello. Rosibel. Uh, I, I cannot hear you. Rosibel? Oh. Now, can you hear me? Ahora sí. Yes. Yes, yes. Uh, I don't know what happened with my internet. No sé qué, qué le está pasando a mi internet. No? Oscar, Need to pay. Hello. I can't Need see. to pay. <laughs> nice. Sorry. Eh? Okay. Uh, no problem. My, my internet, I don't know what happened. Yes, it's. Aún sigue muy bajo mi banda de, de internet. Um, the rest of you, can you hear me? Los demás me escuchan? Debbie? Ever? Yes, teacher. Yes, yes. yes. Okay, sorry. I was lost, like, hey, hello. <laughs> okay, sorry. Eh, si, se, si me vuelvo a cortar, me esperan, por favorcito, yes. Vamos a reponer unos cinco minutitos por lo que perdimos. Sorry, sorry, eh. Okay, I will share my, I will share the presentation, yes? Okay, give me a second here. Okay. Turn on your cameras, please. Turn on your cameras, please. Okay, now here we have, um, the questions for tonight, right? These are the questions for tonight. Um, annoying thing, right? Cosas que me molestan, cosas que me incomodan, right? Annoying things, yes? Uh, oh, and then we have this first question, right? Number one, do you think you have habits that annoy other people? Uh, <laughs> Wendy, can you answer this question for me, please? Okay. Do you think you have Hello, my internet comes and goes, comes and goes, so sorry. I ask you, patient, please excuse me. <laughs> now, let me see. I'm going to try again. I'm going to try again. Uh, I was listening to Wendy. Now, Wendy, continue, please. Okay. Um, I can't see the... the you the cannot screen? see the screen. Okay. Give me a second. So, give me a second. Now, no, I see it. Okay. Wait, wait. Again. Uh, I can see again, it again. again. <laughs> My gosh. I feel embarrassed, sorry. <laughs> so Wendy, please. Don't worry about it. Okay, thank you, thank you. Now, do you think you have habits that um, annoy other people, Wendy? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you, yes. The first question. Please, right? yeah, the first question. Uh, uh, I think that I have a habit that sometimes I know it to my parents. That is that I, I like to sleep a lot. <laughs> <laughs> and <laughs> yeah, for example, on, on Sundays, I wake up, I wake up too, too um, late. Oh. And sometimes my mom got angry because of that, but. Wendy, like why, <laughs> why don't you wake up do and clean the house? 
Yes. I imagine. Yes, I imagine. But I'm so tired and I sleep a lot. I imagine. Okay, I imagine, right? Yeah. Yes, but but what do you consider late, Wendy? Because, for example, for me, late is 11 um, a.m., right? Yeah. 11, huh? 12. What? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah, because uh, and then even, I work all the week. <laughs> yeah, well, oh. yes, I cannot sleep. It's the cost, so maybe I am very old, but when I wake up, um, it's like seven, eight the most, you know. But <laughs> 11, I'm, I'm making everything right. Oh my God. Good. Now, so Beth, the same question to you, please. <laughs> Thank you, Wendy. Thank you. Sonia Ivette, the same question. Mm, mm, Be honest. <laughs> not, not really, but okay. Well, no sé. <laughs> but some things I very demanding with my coworkers. Ah, okay. So they when you are asking your coworkers, slow, they say... relaxed with the with the with the job, and I like the 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 fast. Oh, I am uh, very good. But you're not a boss, or, or yes, Sonia? No. Not kind of. I'm a supervisor. Uh, okay, I understand. <laughs> I understand, yes. Okay, good. Um, what about you, Oscar? Same question. Same question, sorry. Excuse me, teacher. I don't put attention. Okay, good. You didn't you, you didn't pay attention, so I will repeat the question. Uh, Wendy said that uh, when she sleeps late, uh, it's something that her parents don't like. It's it's annoying for her parents, right? And Sonny Bet said that when she's demanding with her coworkers, it's something that annoys them, right? What about you? <coughs> I'm sorry. Uh, do you have something that annoy other people, Oscar? That annoys, sorry, annoy people. Mm, they annoy other people. That but bothers that... other people, that other people don't like about you. Let's, for, let's say, for example, when you, if you child, or if you like to do things very fast, or if you make noise when you're uh, slurping the soup, or when you, if you say mean words, you know, malas palabras, or if you smoke, things like those, you know, or, or you like to drive too fast. No, I don't know, I don't know. Something that bothers other people. Yes, maybe other people uh, when they talk and the voice, the high high voice, mm -hmm. maybe annoyed. Uh -huh. Only this uh, when the for work or for homework or for work uh, annoyed, uh, maybe. Um, I don't explain. I understand. <laughs> it's like like me and my family, right? So my wife sometimes tells me, hey, ¿Por qué habla tan fuerte, come on? Yes. Uh -huh. But it, this is a condition of, of a teacher, you know, because I'm a I'm teacher. I like to speak aloud. So, <laughs> and sometimes I know, or when I'm, I'm talking on the phone, Oscar, uh -huh, I'm not, I'm not gay, okay. yeah, I'm sorry. This is some voice. Uh -huh. I mean, but it's a custom, right, Oscar? Yeah. Well, anyway, so Debbie, does it annoy you when people kiss in public? No. No, you don't care. No. Okay. No, it's not my problem. <laughs> <laughs> okay, nice. Okay, I like that attitude, right? It's not your problem, I know. Okay, now... um. Domingo, welcome, Domingo. Uh, do do you get annoyed 
when someone cuts in front of you, when you are waiting in line, in a clinic, in the bank, or everywhere, right? You go. And some of people, like you say in Spanish, right, Domingo? Alguien se le adelante en la línea, right? Someone cuts in front. Do you get annoyed? Se molesta uh, alguna? Domingo? Uh, Uh, um, ¿cómo se molesta? Okay, when you're making a line in the bank, Domingo, or in a clinic, or in a concert, wherever you go, right? And some, some uh, people uh, cut, alguna una, una persona se adelanta en la línea, right? So, so. Uh, the, the pain, teacher, I see the, the person uh, is, is, is you. Uh, grandmother or grandfather, the, 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 the you people. Oh, all uh, people is, is okay. No problem. Okay. Uh, no, no problem. It's if I want the, um, it's the, the main, the, 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 the violence. Yes. When it's a, uh, Domingo, when it's a young person, when it's a young person, you get annoyed, right? But when the person is old, no problem. No problem, huh? Okay, oh. I understand. Uh -huh. Okay, I understand, nice. Now, Walter, please, hello, welcome. Thank you, Domingo, thank you. What, what annoys you as a result of recent technology, Walter? What things bother you? Talking about technology, computers, Tablets, cell phones, even cars that are really modern, right? There's something that annoys you. Well, I, I, I know there's some very well that question. Okay. Why annoy you about all of the technology? For example, right? Uh, when, um, People don't, don't like to speak with you, right? But they prefer to stay in the cell phone, for example, right? Or, or I don't know, uh, people prefer making TikToks instead of uh, having relation with people, right? Or... Uh, understood. Understand? Yeah. Uh... I think uh, a back habit uh, from the technology is driving, driving a car using the phone, uh, answer the, the machine. So when the, when the back case uh, uh, answer a call. Okay. I agree, right? It also bothers me. It also annoys me when people do that, right? Thank you, Walter. Thank you. Rosibel? I'm sorry, Walter? In the bus, too? Voice knows also, yeah. Ah, okay. No, also. Okay. Rosibel, please, next question to you. Does the smoking bother you? Yes, yes. 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 For me, it's, it's offensive. So you don't smoke, right, Rosibel? You don't smoke. Rosibel? Okay. I guess she has some trouble with the internet. Can you hear me? I understand totally because can, I have. Can you hear me? Hey, Rosibel? Hello. Rosibel? Hello, teacher. Yes, yes, yes. I can hear you. Rosibel? My gosh. Hola. Yes, yes, come on. Hola. 
Yes, Rosibel, I can hear you. Okay, I yeah. say, I said, uh, it's offense for me. Okay. I, I don't like. Nice. I well, no, I mean nice. No, I mean don't. Yes, it's offensive. That's of course, right? Listen, when I driving, so for example, uh, the guy that is in front of me, or uh, that is driving ahead of me, right? Sometimes they are smoking, and you feel when well, you're, well, because I like to open my my window, right? You know. And I, I feel this, the smoking, right? Or some guys smoking in front of children. Right? Oh, it bothers me. I hate that. Right? Okay. What about you, Wendy? Does smoking offend you? Yes. Yeah. I don't like that people smoke in front of me. Or, for example, when I was walking the street and someone is smoking, uh, I don't like this sense. Okay, it's very annoying, right? Very disgusting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. cool. Okay, let me see. Um, I will take the attendance. What time is it? Yes, it's too late. Sorry, eh? Perdimos varios minutos porque, sorry, my, my internet today, right? Nunca me había pasado, así que <laughs> se venía y se iba. Sorry, eh? I'm really. Say, I'm sorry. Uh, hello, Trini, are you there? Trini? Okay, good, thank you. Aminda? Aminda, are you there? Ana Maria? Okay, give me a second. Okay, thank you, Ana Maria. Carlos? Carlos William? Present. Present. Yes. Okay. yes. Thank you, Carlos. Thank you. Claudia Guadalupe? And Domingo? Thank you. Uh, ever? Ever? Jose Roberto? Present teacher. Thank you, Jose Roberto. Carla Vanessa? Present teacher. Thank you. Welcome, Carla. Leticia Guadalupe. Uh, Mariano. Hi, teacher. Present. Good, good, good. Thank you. Give me a second. Mariano and Ever, right? Mariano Ever. Okay. Um, Oscar. Uh, no. Present. Good. Thank you. Rosemary. Rosemary. Rosibel. Present. Good. Thank you. Sonia Ever. Present. Vanessa Noemi. Vanessa, Walter, present, Wendy, present, Chamba, present, Mister. Thank you. Welcome, Chamba. Uh, Debbie, Debbie, present. Thank you. Jorge Alfredo, present. Okay. Thank you, Debbie. Jorge Alfredo. That's it, right? Let me see again. Uh, Aminda. No, Aminda is not tonight. Claudia Guadalupe. Ah, yes, present, you say. 
Good. And Leticia. No, Leticia is not here tonight. Rosemary. Vanessa Noemi. Okay. So let's continue, right? Let's continue. And then I have Trini. Trini, look at the topic we're talking tonight. And this question is for you, right? Do you get annoyed? Se enoja, le molesta, right? Do you get annoyed when other people display bad manners? Mala educación, right? Bad manners. Um, Vini, the under. Hello, hello. Can you hear me? Hi. Yes. Yes. Okay. My guys, tonight is not my night. Yes, every time it, my internet is not working appropriately, right? So uh, we were talking to Trini, right? So Trini. Depends situation. Okay, for example, when someone say bad words, mean words, right? Do you get annoyed? Because that's bad, bad manner, right? But when people don't say hello, right? Only go seem to end it. Does it bother you, Trini? Does it bother you, Trini, when somebody is saying bad words or somebody spits? <laughs> Right? Or oh, somebody is speaking and chewing gum, you know, mascando chicle. Hello, how are you? You know, does it bother you, Trini? Okay, let me see. Ana Maria, uh, can you participate, Ana Maria? Puede participar, Ana Maria? Okay, so let me see. She's listening tonight. Yeah. Now, let me see. Carlos. Hello, Carlos. Hello. Hi, welcome, Carlos. So, listen, do you get annoyed when other people display bad manners? Yes. For example, I, I don't like when the people is noisy with it. I don't like this sound. It's disgusting for me. Uh, yeah. So I, I will never speak on the phone in front of you, <laughs> Carlos, because people say I am noisy when I speak on the cell phone, right? Sorry. <laughs> it's not my intention, right? Okay, nice. But other people, yes. When when we are in a <laughs> restaurant, right? And or when we are in public, some people are very noisy. Yes. Yeah. Okay, thank you, Carlos. Now, uh, don't, let me see. Ever, ever está de listener o puede participar, Ever? Okay, so Jose Roberto, please. Jose Roberto. Okay, so Carla Vanessa, please. Help me, Carlita. Ah, Mariano, Mariano. Yes, yeah, well, well, at first Car Carla and then Mariano, right? Um, what is the most annoying thing for you, Carla? Oh, it's a difficult one. Well, I don't like when the, <laughs> when the people are eating soup and they mm -hmm. make a, a noise. I understand. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I don't like that. Okay, that's the most uh, annoying thing for you. I hate it. Okay. Yes. 
Thank you. Thank you very much, Carla Vanessa. And what about you, Mariano? Mariano? For, yes, sure. For me, ah. uh, the most annoying thing for me is the, the people the in the world people you say the people huh? repeat and, this repeat well give me a second right listen please hello? listen yes mariano i listen to you uh, okay. yo no sé si es la quizás okay. en la red nacional Pero creo que a todos nos está dando problemas ahorita el internet, ¿no? Ah, no yo sí, sí. La banda que yo tengo, Mariano, es un poco amplia. Es decir, no tendría que fallarme, ¿no? Pero ya me sacó como siete veces. Sí, tampoco. Yeah, y, y, y mío, le oigo ah, Mariano, le oigo cortado. No suelo tener problemas. No. Sí, sí, normalmente no, no le, siempre le escucho bien, pero ahorita le, le escucho cortado, Mariano. Va, vamos a intentar una vez más. Okay. Again. Uh, what is the most annoying thing for you? Right, Mariano? Uh, for me, this is an... Can you hear me, teacher? Yes, yeah, now I can listen. Yes, ahorita sí. Come on, go ahead. Okay. The slow people, teacher. Ah, slow. And when the... In the works. <laughs> in the world <laughs> i understand <laughs> okay. when, when you say uh, for for another people to make a uh, work or make something and he think and think and think and never make i understand yeah i hate that you know because i i like to do the thing like this everything right when i'm working to do this make this exam Yes, because but some people uh, they walk even yes. walking, you know, and they are not old. Some people yes. are not old. This okay, I understand, Mariano. Yeah, I, I totally agree, right? <laughs> Oscar, another question for you, Oscar. If something is annoying you, what do you usually do, Oscar? But at me, maybe don't respect the people. Ah, oh, when the when the entry is any any place, you can saludar. Uh, say hello or greet. Uh, say hello, say greet, and uh, and I people uh, only entry. Yes, like. Like it's, animalito, it's no right? But even the, yeah. the even the dog, for example, even the dog say hello. Sometimes they they move the tail, right? But some people, oh my god, yes. I have mm -hmm. I have a neighbor, right? That sometimes I, I I I walk in front of him and and I say good morning, and he never say anything. Just go like this, right? I hate this. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Lo, lo ignoran, lo ignoran. I know. Yes. Yes, that's why I admire the people in the country, right? Admiro la gente del campo. Yeah, they always say good morning. They always say good afternoon. Yes. Okay, but yes, in other countries, uh, the expression, the face expression, the people is great when uh -huh. they say hello. How are you? Yeah, and sometimes. Some people are like, they don't care. And then we don't care about them, right? Yeah. Listen, Oscar, when okay. I say, I say like one, two, three times, good morning, and they never answer, then I, I stop, right? I stop saying hello. Those yes. people are like that, you know? Okay. Thank you very much. Now, let me see. Next question, right? Let me see. Uh, Oscar, Rosemary, no, there. Rosibel, please. Rosibel, what are some things that car drivers do that annoy you? 
um, no respete or okay uh Rosibel, but of course I'm not talking about buceros and micro buceros, right? They are a special people. <laughs> but normal driver, right? Uh huh, Rosibel. Yeah, it's a. Uh, it's just the 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 one things. When they the, don't the respect. When they don't respect the light, the red light, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Um, the same question to to Wendy. Do you drive, Wendy? Do you drive? Um, um sometimes I sometimes. don't really drive. What? But what, what what are something that car drivers do that that you don't like? That I know. Uh, I don't like that people honk the horn. Uh, in nothing, traffic, right? For example. Uh, it's impossible because if it is a traffic <laughs> on the earth, don't resolve the problem. <laughs> You're so, right. I don't like. You're totally right. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's like honking, right? Honk is not going to make the cars move magically, right? Or disappear. So in the, that you magically is going to, ah, I will move. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Nice. So, thank you. These people well, need an airplane. <laughs> I know. Yes. Yeah. Hey, Walter, what about you? The same question. What car drivers do that that annoys you? When the other drivers don't use uh, direction lines when chains when chase street or lane. Okay, nice, good. Now, you know, something that bothers me is when when, when there is a, a green line for you, right? But the other the other side of the of the uh, in front of you, there are many cars. So it's sure that if you pass, when the lights change, you're going to stay in the middle of the street, right? So, and then I, what I do is that I wait. Because when the, the semaphore, when the light changes, I permit the other cars pass in front of me, right? But, you know, I repeat, sorry for the buceros and micro buceros, but they, come on. They go even, they so, know that the light is going to change and they stay there and it's worth for everybody, right? Okay. People, people, people use the, the oil. And uh, to go fast and, and, and no easy is for 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 have more prevention the orange orange mm -hmm. line. Yes, but no, they use that lane. Lane is right, Walter. The lane, right? Linear. Uh huh. And that is for emergencies. Yes, I agree. I agree with you. Right? And there are many things, right? The people driving. You know, and, and annoys everybody, right? Now, let me see. Chamba, hello, Chamba. Can you think? No, in, Mr. Can you think uh, of something children do, children, right, do that annoy people around them? Yes, Mr. Maybe when the kids hits they're toy in the floor or or how do you say tirar when they uh, just uh fell on the uh, fall on the on the floor right mm -hmm. just with intention right yes or yes uh, yes mister uh, it's in english it's say uh, pouring right pouring Haciendo un puchero, haciendo un eh, capricho, right? Mm -hmm. Is let me see. Uh, in, in the son of Santa Claus, oh, right. pout is pout. P O U T. Pout is eh, como uh, tirarse al suelo, hacer uh, un berrinche. That's the word, hacer un berrinche, right? 
Pout. P O U T. Pout. Is the mm, is the same to they cry without reason. Yeah. Yeah. Without uh, they cry aloud without reason. Yeah, and it's embarrassing for the parent, right? It's embarrassing yes. for the parent, yes. Yeah. And some parents don't care about that, you know. And people <laughs> are watching all the time, you know. Oh, okay. You know, then you're thinking that, right? Okay, Chamba, thank you. Now, Debbie. You're welcome, Mr. Thank you, thank you. Um, what, well, first, let me explain, Debbie, what is a pet peeve, right? A pet peeve is something that bothers you but maybe doesn't bother other people. Let's say, for example, right? That some people are chewing gum, right? Chewing gum, right? You know, macando chicle, right? And I, I hate that, you know? Or let's say, Walter, <clears throat> Walter hates that, right? But us, for Oscar, no. For Oscar, say, no, I don't care when people are chewing gum, right? Right, or maybe uh, Domingo say, I don't like when people listen in rock and roll, you know? But then Oscar says, oh, for me, it's not a problem, right? So a pet peeve is something that bothers you, but maybe doesn't bother other people, right? Algo que me molesta a mí, pero probablemente no le molesta a otra gente, yes? So now what is one of your pet peeves, Debbie? No, no, okay. You don't, you don't know, but but do you understand the question? Mm, so, so. Well, uh, other example, right? Other example, I will tell you this, right? I don't like when people listen reggaeton. Sorry. When people listen reggaeton, I, I, I feel uncomfortable. I don't know why, but. I don't like. I know, but but you can listen. I mean, you can listen. You say, ah, oh, for me, it's not a problem. I don't like reggaeton, but ah, I can listen, right? But in my case, it's a pet peeve. I get uncomfortable when, when somebody's listening to reggaeton, right? Do you have one of these things? Maybe when someone is small. When someone is small, right? OK. Well, it, it could be a, a pet peeve because some people don't don't care, right? Say, ah, I can fool me, me vale, you know. But you know, in your case, you you don't no, like. No, for it. me, it's uh, no, I don't like. Okay, good. Uh, Domingo, please. Next question is for you, Domingo. What kind of people? Qué tipo de persona, right? Kind of people annoy you. Uh, like the, the people uh, annoy you is the 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 violence violent violence violent uh -huh. uh -huh, violent uh -huh. <laughs> People that are violent, right? Okay. Uh, uh, yes, I know. The uh, people that mis, misbehave, misbehave. It's like, se porta mal, que es mal creado, right? Uh-huh. Uh, okay. Uh, no, no. Mal creado, no, sí. No, de, de, ¿cómo se dice la palabra? Eh... De, Propotencia de, de, de superioridad, algo así. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, people that uh, likes to brag. Brag. B-R-A-G, right? Brag. Right. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah. the, the people right is, mm -hmm. I know. So they feel they I are like more than other people. Say, I am more than you. You are not important. Or oh, mm -hmm. they, uh, they like to discriminate 
right? Others. Yeah, that's it. Okay, I hate those people too. Yeah. And, and you know, people that they believe because uh, that you are you are a kid you or because you are old or because you are a woman or because you work for the government right solo porque trabaja con el gobierno right so or solo porque es mujer solo porque es anciano so then you say you have to do this for me you know and that's it right i don't like those kind of people that it's okay i mean we have to respect children women old people the police also of course right but it must be something that is natural right not it's like oh you have to do right it's obligation right okay thank you domingo thank you very much for yes. your commentary let me see we have this question right um let's say um give me a second here trini hello trini trini Hello. Okay. Hello. Uh, who is the most annoying person you know? La persona más odiosa cae mal, right? The most annoying person you know in your life, Trini. Your neighbor, a friend, an ex friend, <laughs> your <laughs> mother in um, love, you know. <clears throat> who? Not a thing. Huh? Nobody? No, I think. No, nobody. nobody. Nobody, okay. You love all people. Okay. You love all people. Nice. You're a pacifist, Trini. You're a pacifist. <laughs> nice. Yes. <laughs> okay. You don't like to get in trouble. So that's nice, right? Okay, Carlos. Uh, next question. How do you inform someone yes. they are being annoying? How do you tell someone you are annoying? You, I don't like you do that. How do you inform the person? Um, maybe I I say these things that I don't like me and. Uh -huh. So you're honest with the, with the with the person, Carlos. You are honest with the person. Yes, I prefer be honest. Nice, nice. It's good. Yes, because if, if someone is doing something that you don't like, you tell them, right? That's it. Okay, thank you, Carlos. Now yes. let me see. Uh, let me see. Um, Jose Roberto. Okay, let's go back to Carla Vanessa again. Car hello. Carlita. Hello, teacher. Ah, yes, Roberto. Hello, welcome. Okay, so this is a question for you, right? Uh, okay. do, you, do you think, do you believe other people find you annoying? Uh, yes, uh, yes, I think some people <laughs> try to annoy me sometimes. <laughs> okay, good. I know, I know. Some people are like that, but but listen to the question, Robert. Sorry, I don't okay. want to, to offend you, right? But do you think other other people think that you are annoying? Ah, uh, well, I think <laughs> I think yes. Oh, really? Why is that? I don't find you annoying, yeah. Robert. I I think you are agreeable. Se ve como una persona muy agradable, Robert. So, well, I, I think we don't, uh, we don't say uh, the, the good for for all people. Ah, yes, I know. It's, I understand what you mean. Yes, we don't, it's like you say, hey, no somos monedita de oro, right? I don't know how yes. to say that in English. <laughs> Yes, you don't, no, no, I mean, no, I don't know how to say it in English, sorry. It's like, um, you don't like everybody. Yes, you don't like everybody, yes. And well, 
and that's it. It's impossible, right? It's impossible. I like that. Per Everybody says, oh, I love you. Come on, you are the best. No, no, come on. Maybe there is a person, right? In my case also, I know mm -hmm. that I bother some people too. <laughs> yes. Okay. Next question, right, Wendy? Who is the... Thank you, Roberto. Thank you. Uh, Wendy, who is the most annoying celebrity? Um, for me, Bad Bunny. <laughs> I, totally, <laughs> I totally agree. <laughs> I totally. First one, because I hate reggaeton. I can't listen to reggaeton. My and goodness. Second one, Wendy, Bad Bunny. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't know, but he's annoying for me. Oh, cool. I, I can't even hear, hear the music. I don't know. When oh. the, the music of a bunny sounds in the radio, for example. Oh, my God. Wendy, it, for me, it's a, it's a pet peeve. Bad bunny. <laughs> for me, too. <laughs> is a pet peeve for me, you know. Yes. <laughs> I hate it. I literally hate it, right? Yeah. Me, too. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Other celebrity, Rosibel, that you consider annoying? I don't know, like Justin Bieber, Cristiano Ronaldo. I don't know, who? Some, 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 Madonna. Madonna. Okay. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I like the music, but don't have to use it. Okay. Very good. Thank you, Rosibel. Hey, teacher. Yes, Piquet. Piqué. Piqué. Oh, yes. Yes, Piqué is an annoying. Yes. Uh, especially now, right? That he was cheating Shakira, yes? Yes. Cheating on Shakira. It's, uh, but this. Yes, I is a Yeah, Piqué is a. Pet peeve. <laughs> and Domingo, what about you? Do you have a celebrity that you don't like? Uh, the bad boy. Uh -huh. The boy is uh, 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 I don't know, I don't know the music, the, the, the reggaeton. Okay. The, pers the personal is, uh, um, I don't like. The, okay, the good. Music. Mm -hmm. Thank you, thank you. Now, Walter, please. The last question is for you, Walter. Does it annoy you when people don't use the right punctuation in Spanish? Cuando escriben con mala ortografía, right? Because it's Spanish, right? When people don't use the right punctuation. For me, it's annoying, but sometimes I, I do punctuation too. You, you, are, not, you are not very good in, 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 or, uh, in punctuation, in, in ortografía, in Spanish, Walter? Uh, I think uh, I uh, uh, and to improve too. Good. When you read, you improve a lot, right? So don't worry about that. No, I like to, because, you know, I am a teacher, right? So uh, I teach lenguaje in Spanish. In, in the school, right? And one of the subjects that I teach is, uh, part of the language is orthographia, right? And, and I love to read. I love to read, right? And the best way to improve orthographia, right, is reading, reading, yes. And, but, but for me, it's okay. I mean, se vende, right? Se e. Se vende, you know, I have, I have, well, for me, it's, it's, it's funny, right, to, to see some, some, I can say, right, uh, uh, sign, you know, rotulo, right, 
se alquila con Cayo, ¿no? <laughs> yes, um, etc., etc. Even in English, right, you know? When I see the password. Well, sometimes it could be, yes. But, you know, um, it, it's, it's also funny for me in English that some buses put some, some expression, you know, like uh, they try to say, right, uh, bendecido por Dios or, or some, some expression that are, are not correct in, in English, you know? And I say, okay. Trataron de ponerle un sticker en inglés y no, no saben inglés, you know? And then I say, ah, oh, it's funny. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, and it's very common, you know, especially for the buses. They put some stickers that are not, they don't have good punctuation, right? Okay, class. Thank you very much for your participation. Thank you for your patience. Thank you very much. I hope my internet gets better, right? And now we're going to go to the manual, right? Let's go to the manual. Ah, no, no, sorry, sorry, I missed something, right? Me faltó algo aquí. Excuse me, excuse me. Me faltó algo aquí en la presentación, yes. Give me a second. Yes, that's it, right? <clears throat> the, the, the objective, right? Um, Wendy, can you read the objective for tonight, please? Okay. Uh, loyalty. I will able to discriminate effective from ineffective ways to increase brand awareness. Good, brand awareness, thank you. And the topic is, uh, the, well, this is not a grammar, I guess is kind of punctuation maybe, right? How to avoid double negatives, right? For example, oops, uh, there is a mistake here. Aquí, perdone, que quería un error aquí, let me see. Vamos a corregirlo. Yes, uh, nothing is. Okay, here, right? Good. Now, for example, I don't know nothing. Yo no sé nada. How do you say yo no sé nada in English, right? I don't know nothing. <laughs> okay, she never doesn't go. She never doesn't go. Ella nunca va. Ella nunca lo hace. She never doesn't do. Right? So we have don't. Here, look. And we have, oops, sorry. And we also have nothing, right? Don't is negative and nothing is negative. So double negative. She never, never is negative and doesn't is negative, right? Okay. That's it, right? So two negatives in a sentence are considered ungrammatically in English, right? Not correct. Not correct. Like se vende hielo <laughs> would say, right? Incorrect. The recommendation is to avoid using them, right? Okay, that's it. That's it. Right now, I have a question. I will copy here the question. Listen. Uh, happiness wait a minute happiness okay and I will make it bigger uh, okay wait a minute good now, before we continue, I have this question, right? For everybody, you tell me right or wrong, right? Right or wrong? Trini, this word is correct or incorrect? Happiness. Trini? Incorrect. Incorrect. For you, it's incorrect, right? Okay. And Ana Maria? The ones that are listening, right? Lo que están de listener pueden mandarlo en el chat. So only copy correct or incorrect, right? Okay, let me see. And then, Carlos, for you, happiness, correct or incorrect? 
I don't know. You don't know. You're not sure. Okay, good. Domingo? Happiness. Correct incorrect. or incorrect? Incorrect. Incorrect for you. Okay. Ever? Jose Roberto? I think incorrect. Incorrect. Okay. Carla Vanessa? Mariano? Ah, oh, yes, Calabonesa, yes, come on. Incorrect. Okay, for Mariano is correct and for Carla Vanessa, incorrect. Good, thank you. Incorrect. Ah, incorrect. incorrect. <laughs> yes. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, the microphone, right, Mariano? Yes. Yes, I don't know what happened. Y ni está lloviendo, ¿eh? ¿Qué pasa? Que no están cortando el internet. <laughs> okay, so incorrect, Mariano. Thank you. Oscar? Oscar, correct or incorrect? Correct. Okay, thank you. Sonia Ivette? It's incorrect. It's incorrect for you. Hey, Vanessa, Noemi, welcome. Vanessa, correct or incorrect? Incorrect. Incorrect. Okay, good. That's it. That's enough. I, I have the poll here, right? Later, we're going to see a conversation. We're going to see a conversation and you're going to tell me, oh, it's correct. Oh, it's incorrect, right? But I have a Spanish expression. It's a Spanish, sorry. But you're going to tell me if it is right or, or, or not, right? Uh, for Rosibel, listen, Rosibel. Tell me, correct or incorrect? Yo haré lo que pude. Yo haré lo que pude. Correct or incorrect? This is a Spanish, no English, no English, Spanish. Yo haré lo que pude. Incorrect. 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 Oh. Incorrect. In my opinion, is correct. But Rosibel say no, right? Okay, no problem. No problem. No problem, right? Uh, Walter, for you, yo haré lo que pude. Correct or incorrect? Sorry, I can't hear you. Uh, all right, here. Hello. Okay, I will repeat slowly. Vamos a repetir suave. Yo haré lo que pude. Correct o incorrect, Walter? Uh, okay. Wendy, thank you, Walter. Wendy, yo haré lo que pude. Um, I'm not sure, but I'm thinking that is incorrect. Incorrect. It sounds incorrect for me, but I don't know. No, okay. Wendy, listen, I am the teacher, remember, right? Yes. So I'm telling you it's correct. Yo le digo que está uh, correct. So it's correct. Ah, okay, Sorry. thank you, Wendy, for sure. <laughs> no, come on. <laughs> Pero piénselo. <laughs> yes, I'm thinking for the reason okay. that I say that I'm not sure because... You're not sure, right? Are, but I am the no, teacher, you know? And, if you okay. say that it's correct, it's correct for me. <laughs> no, come on, Wendy. Thank you for trusting me, right? Now, Chamba, what do you think, Chamba? Listen, listen, Chamba, it's yo haré lo que pude. Incorrect. Yes. Incorrect for you. You don't trust me, right, Chamba? No, no confía en mí, right? <laughs> I'm kidding, right? And Debbie, please. Debbie? Yo haré lo que pude. <laughs> Tell me, be honest. No me suena bien. For you, it's incorrect. Right? Yes. Okay, I will copy. Listen, I will copy. Yes? Expresivamente, literal, escrito, escrito lateralmente no es tan correcto, pero expresivamente sí es correcto la expresión. Ok, bueno. Well, pero ya copy. gramaticalmente no sé. Creo I que will no. copy, listen. Yo haré, sorry, yo haré lo que pude. Es incorrecto porque está hablando como 
que está en futuro y luego en pasado. Ok, Trini, look, please. Y haré, writing haré that llevar... way is correct. Writing Yo that haré is correct la tierra. Because you are using a verb. Yes. Yo haré la tierra. Yo haré la tierra. De arar. Yo haré lo que pude. Yo estuve arando lo que estuve. pude. Uh, yes, uh, it's correct. It's correct. Uh, it's correct right? ¿Qué era de hacer? Solo Wendy, hacer? Solo Wendy confía en mí. <laughs> Thank you, Wendy. Thank you, Wendy. Thank Te vamos a juntar en la plataforma. <laughs> ok. Good. Thank you. It's a joke, right? Don't worry. It's a joke. It's a grammatical joke in Spanish, right? Ok. Let's go to the manual, right? Hoy sí, vámonos al manual. Ok. Here we have a conversation, right? Ok. Let me see. I have a commentary here. Ah, oh, okay, Sonia. <laughs> Thank you, Sonia. Okay, <laughs> good. Now, uh, here we have this conversation, right? Um, and then it's Olivia and, and Leo, Leo, right? In English, Leo, right? It sounds like a problem, right? But it's the correct pronunciation, Leo. And they're talking about this, right? Uh, the correct branding or, or, or marketing, right? So listen to the conversation. Olivia says, I'm trying to set on an online business selling handmade dresses, but I don't know nothing about branding or marketing. I don't know nothing. And Leo said, you mean you don't know anything, Olivia? To start, you could stop changing the logo of your business. I noticed you change it at least five times last week and think the spelling in your slogan, designing happiness. That's not correct. I never noticed nothing about that spelling mistake when I made it, but you know, it makes it look original. You mean you never notice anything. I think you better hire a consultant, Olivia. They will help you with the business. So notice class happiness is incorrect. The correct is H-A-P-P-I-N-E-S, happiness, right? Yes? Okay. Now, please repeat us to me. Turn off your microphone and repeat us to me. I'm trying to set an online business selling handmade dresses. I'm trying to set an online business selling handmade dresses. But I don't know nothing about branding or marketing. Branding, marketing. You mean you don't know anything, Olivia? You don't know anything, Olivia. To start, you could stop changing the logo of your business. Changing, logo. Business. I noticed you change it at least five times last week. Noticed. Simple part, right? I noticed. Change it. Change. Change it. Change. Simple present. Change it and change it, simple part, right? At least five times last week. And fix the spelling in your slogan. Fix the spelling in your slogan. Designing happiness. That's not correct. 
I never noticed nothing about that spelling mistake. I never noticed nothing about that spelling mistake when I made it. Spelling. Mistake. But you know, it makes it look original. It makes it look original. And Leo says, you mean you never noticed anything? Noticed, noticed anything. I think you better hire a consultant, Olivia. Hire. You better. Consultant. They will help you with the business. They will help you with the business. Business, sorry. Okay, that is the pronunciation, right? I will take the attendance the second time. And then I need you practice this conversation, right? Trini? Present. Thank you. Aminda? Present. Oh, hello, Aminda. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Uh, Ana Maria? Creo que Ana Maria va a estar the listener. Okay. Thank you. Uh, Carlos? Oh, yes. Por aquí está Ana Maria. Let me see. Yes, Ana Maria. Thank you. Now, uh, Carlos? Present. Thank you. Claudia Guadalupe? Domingo? Present. Ever? Ever? Okay, Jose Roberto. Present teacher. Thank you. Carla Vanessa. Carla Vanessa. Present. Good. Thank you, Carla. You're always ready, right? Sir, yes, sir. <laughs> nice, Carla. I like your punctuality and your attendance. Uh, Leticia Guadalupe. Present teacher. Hey, hello, Leticia. Hello, eh, hello, listen, ayer estaba felicitando a todos los que han terminado la plataforma. Y usted está entre los que ya lo terminaron, Leticia. Así que yo sé que a veces no se conecta por la... Le está fallando el internet. Y ahora la entiendo bien sí, porque... Teacher. Ajá. De hecho, ya te... yo hace dos semanas terminé el Zoom las cuatro unidades. Ah, océano. Al mar no le digo océano. Al mar no le digo mar, le digo océano. Ok. Very good, Leticia. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, that's it. Nice, nice, yes. Uh, aprovechando. No, sé si el... le aparece, si le no, yes. Sí, me apareció desde hace rato. Está ahí. Yes, nice. Uh, aprovechando el comercial, en el que tomo la asistencia. Um, por favor, mañana no me vaya a faltar nadie. Le suplico que nadie vaya a faltar porque vamos a hacer una encuesta a las ocho y media, exactamente. Ocho y media. Eight thirty, right? Eh, recuérdense que esa encuesta, me imagino que ya la hicieron todo, ¿verdad? Alguna vez. Y los que no lo han hecho, pues no se preocupen, ahí les voy a ir dirigiendo yo, ¿sí? Eh, me hacen la encuesta, le hacen una captura de pantalla y me la envían al grupo de WhatsApp. Pues mañana se lo voy a explicar bien, pero por favorcito, no me vayan a fallar mañana, please. Aparte que es la última clase junto, ¿verdad? Después van a tener otro teacher. ¿Verdad? Uno que cuenta chistes buenos y no chistes malos, como yo los cuento. <ríe> ¿Ok? Así que, por favor, no vayan a fallar. ¿Ok? Good evening, teacher. Hello, hello. Hi, everyone. Good evening. Welcome, welcome. Nice. Thank you. Yes. I'm here. Now, yes. Again, right? Sir, yes, sir. Present. Yes. Say, yes, sir. Listen, ever, I was telling everybody that don't miss the class tomorrow, because tomorrow we're going to make a poll. Mañana vamos a hacer una pequeña encuesta. This okay, team. perfect. You know, I, 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 I try imagine. To be here. Okay, good. 
I try to be there because I I am estoy saliendo tarde de trabajar. I know. Uh, we're going to make the yes. poll ever at 8.30. El, la encuesta la vamos a estar haciendo a las, a las 8 y 30. ¿Sí? Ok, perfecto. 8 y 30. Pero si usted quiere, a las 8 y media. Como usted prefiera. O a las 9 menos 30. Sí, está bien. Ah, correcto. Me parece mejor eso. <risa> Come on, Ever. You're really smart. Me agrada la gente lista. Yes. Aminda. Hola, teacher. Y no es posible hacer antes la encuesta. Tenemos que hacerla eh, mañana. en conjunto con usted. Mañana. Sí, sí, tenemos que hacerla en conjunto. Es parte de la política de inglés corporativo y de INSAFOR. Tiene es que, que fíjese ser... que yo estoy, yo estoy en auditoría y estoy saliendo tarde. Entonces, por eso es que me estoy uniendo a las nueve ah, casi de la clase. Este, bueno, hagamos algo. Este... Es que tienen que hacerla conmigo, pero eh, si, si puede hacerla después, que nosotros, que el grupo, a las nueve, pero uh, yo estaría monitoreándola. Va. ¿Me parece? Sí. Okay. Uh, y lo podemos hacer por el chat, si quiere, ¿verdad? Si, si usted tiene alguna duda ahí. Ok. Eh, y lo, pues, Ever, no sé si también podría hacerlo a las nueve, pero... Me uno a su solicitud. Ah, muy bien, bien, muy bien. Entonces, hagámoslo a las nueve, pero, pero es decir, ustedes estarían ahí haciéndola, ¿sí? Ok, perfecto, ah, gracias. Tito. Pero, pero eh, remotamente no se pueden, no pueden estar de listeners. ¿Cómo no? Ah, ok. Entonces, Yo... van a escuchar las instrucciones y después, la, eh, ¿cómo se llama? Lo, re, lo replican ustedes, ¿verdad? Porque es... Es de llenar unos datos. Yo me imagino que la mayoría de ustedes ya llenó ese tipo de encuesta, así que no les va a costar. Pero igual, ahí voy a estar yo explicándolo. Y si hay una pregunta extra, me lo hacen en el chat. Pero con okay. todos, con todos lo vamos a hacer a las ocho y media mañana, ¿ok? Ok, perfecto. Gracias. En serio, ok. Thank you. Thank you, Aminda. Thank you. Ok, let's continue with the attendance. Sorry, me quedé en la mitad. So, uh, let me see. Eh, Ever, right? Thank you, Ever. And eh, José Roberto. Yeah, right? Ya, ya había tomado con Carla Vanessa. Yes. Perdón. Eh, Mariano. Hello, Mariano. Hello, teacher. Present. Good. Oscar. Ah, ya me había hecho present en el chat. Sí. Eh, Rosibel. Present. Sonia Ibet. Good. Thank you, Rosibel. Sonia Ibet. Present. Good, thank you. Walter Omar. Present. Thank you. Wendy. Present. Thank you, Wendy. And Chamba. Present, mister. Thank you. Debbie. Present. Jorge Alfredo. No, okay, good. Thank you. Now let's continue with the conversation. Teacher. Right? Yes. Tell me. Me me Ah, uh, uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Vanessa. I'm sorry, Vanessa. Alguien que no haya mencionado. <laughs> qué oso, qué Thank oso. You. Sorry, Vanessa. No se imagina las que me han pasado ahora, ¿verdad? Me sacó siete veces el internet. Me equivoqué en la presentación una letra. Y ahí está que me ha estado fallando también. Pero creo que ya está más estable el internet con todo, ¿verdad? Hasta ahora ya todo el mundo está durmiendo ya. Ok. Now, let's continue. Uh, let's repeat the last time. And then I'm going to ask some volunteers. I'm going to ask some volunteers to repeat the, the conversation. Again, please. Try to repeat, you know, uh, without stopping. So, come on. Microphones off, please. One, two, three. I'm trying to set an online business selling handmade dresses, but I don't know nothing about branding or marketing. Repeat. You mean you don't know anything, Olivia?
To start, you could stop changing the logo of your business. I noticed you changed it at least five times last week. And fix the spelling of your slogan, designing happiness. That's not correct. I never noticed nothing about that spelling mistake when I made it, but you know, it makes it look original. You mean you never noticed anything. I think you better hire a consultant, Olivia. They will help you with the business. Okay, come on, guys, let me see. Two volunteers, please. Ah, Mariano, Mariano and who else? Uh, Vanessa, Vanessa Noemi, okay? Mariano, of course, you are Leo, and Vanessa, you're Olivia. Okay, teacher. Come on, go ahead. I'm trying to set an online business selling handmade dresses, but I don't know nothing about branding or, mar or marketing. You mean you, you don't know anything, Olivia. To start, you call stop changing the logo of the business. I notice, notice is to change it, change it, it all live less five times last week and fix the spelling in your slogan, design happiness. That's not correct. I never noticed nothing about that spelling mistake when I made it, but you know, it makes it original. You mean you never noticed anything. I think you better hire a consultant, Olivia. They will help you with the business. Thank you, Mariano. Change it at least, change it at least. Changing at least. Change, it's past tense, right? Change it at least, at least, sorry. Change it change at least. At least. Thank you, thank you, Mariano. Okay, now, Ever, please, you're going to be Leo. I need an Olivia. Olivia, need to enjoy. <laughs> Olivia. Okay, thank you, Aminda. Ready? One, two, three, action. I trying to set an online business selling handmade dresses, but I don't know nothing about branding or marketing. You mean you don't know anything, Olivia? To start, could stop changing to logo and your business. I noticed you changed it at least five times last week and picked the spelling in your slogan. Designing happiness, that's not correct. I never noticed nothing about the spelling mistake when I made it, but you know it makes it look original. You mean you never noticed anything? I think you better hire a consultant, Olivia. They will help you with the business. Thank you very much for your participation. Thank you. And it says, uh, listen, uh, ever change it. Change it. Change it together, right? Change it. Change it. Okay. I noticed. I noticed. I, I noticed. Good. Thank you. Come on. Two more students. Participation, please. Oh, yeah. Thank you very much, Wendy. Wendy and who's the other? Kimame levantó la mano, sorry. Wendy and Necesito Leo, no, sorry. It's so, it's so funny, right? So no divertido. Neces, neces, ah, yes, Carlos, thank you, Carlos. Necesito Leo, sorry. Okay, so Carlos, you're Leo, right? 
Okay. And Wendy, you are Olivia. Ready? One, two, three. Action. I'm trying to set an online business selling handmade dresses, but I don't know nothing about branding or marketing. You mean you don't know anything, Olivia? To a start, you could stop changing the logo of your business. I noticed you changed it at least five times last week and fixed the spelling in your slogan, designing happiness that's not correct. I never noticed nothing about that spelling mistake when I made it. But you know, it makes it, 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 makes it look original. You mean you never noticed anything. I think you better hire a consultant, Olivia. They will help you with the business. Thank you very much. Listen, Wendy, makes it. Makes it. Makes it. Uh, no, no. Makes it. Makes it. Oh, that's it, Together. right? And okay. Carlos, to start. To start. To start. Mm -hmm. So the E disappear, right? You know, because we're Spanish, are, we are a Spanish speaker, we say a start, but no, no, it's start. 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 Mm -hmm. Like student, Stephen, school. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Okay. Two more, two more, please, come on. Don't be afraid. Yeah, come on. Yes, Carla Vanessa and I need a Leo. <laughs> no, I need a Leo. Okay, Walter. Thank you, Walter. Yes. Carla, you're Olivia, of course. And Walter, you're Leo. There you go. I'm trying to set an online business selling handmade dresses, but I don't know nothing about branding or marketing. You mean you don't know anything, Olivia? To start, you could start changing the logo for your business. I noticed you change it uh, less five times last week. I fixed the spelling and your slogan. Designing happiness, that's not correct. I never noticed nothing about that spelling mistake when I made it, but you know, it makes it look original. You mean you never noticed anything? anything? I think you better hire a consultant. Olivia, they will help you with the business. Thank you very much. Now again, listen uh, to start, to start. Mm -hmm. Remember there is not a need, right? right? You say, esta no, no, to start, to start, right? Okay, thank you, thank you. Anybody else? Okay, good. So, ah, oh yes, Rosibel, thank you, Rosibel. You're going to be uh, Olivia, right? Yes, and I need a Leo again. Yeah, uh, who is it? Rosibel and uh, who's the other? Sorry. Uh, perdón. Ah, Debbie, Debbie, Debbie. Yes, thank you. Debbie. Excuse me. Es que en, en la pantalla me aparece dos participantes, entonces no. No me canso a ver, ok. So, uh, eh, Rosibel, I mean, Debbie, you're going to be Leo, right? And Rosibel, you're going to be Olivia. Oh, Olivia, come on. Okay. I'm trying to set an online business selling handmade dresses, but I don't know nothing about branding or marketing. You mean you don't know anything, Olivia? To start, you could stop changing the logo of your business. I noticed you're changing it as less five times last week and fix the spelling in your slogan, design happiness. That's not correct. Co I never noticed nothing about that spelling mistake when I made it, but you know, it makes it look original. You mean you never notice notice anything? I think you better hire a cost consult, Olivia. They will help you with the business. Thank you, thank you very much. Consultant, right? Debbie, consultant. Uh huh. Thank you. And 
Again, to start. To start. To, to start. That's it. Excellent. Change it. Change it. Change, Change it. it. Slogan. 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 Mm -hmm. It's not your a slogan, but no, your slogan. Your slogan. Your slogan. That's it. Your Thank slogan. you. Thank you very much. Thank you. That's it. Right now, let's go to the next part. It says, uh, here we have two mistakes, right? I don't know nothing about branding or marketing. I never noticed nothing about that spelling mistake. So what are the correct sentences? Class? I don't know. I don't know anything oh. about and branding. I don't marketing. know anything, yes. And number two? I never know, noticed anything about anything. anything again, about. Right? Yes. Why? Because nothing is negative and never is negative. So double, double negative, right? So I never notice anything. That's correct. Now let's go to the next part. Okay. The topic is how to avoid double negative. This is interesting, right? Este me parece un poco interesante porque no es... No es vocabulario de negocio, va, pero... <laughs> okay. It's about double negative. Look. Two negatives in a sentence are considered ungrammatical in English, right? The recommendation is to avoid using them since the result is that a statement like, I don't know nothing, could be interpreted differently as I do know something. I do know something, or oh, oh, anything, right? Look at the examples, contrast. We don't publish nothing or we don't publish anything. The company didn't get no additional or the company, okay, let me see, I need, I listen now. I listen a, an echo, right? Just give me a second here. Um, Okay, let's continue. So the company didn't get no additional sales. The company didn't get any additional sales, right? The experts never, uh, yeah, that's it. The, the expert, oh. Sorry, estamos jugando aquí, sorry. The expert never said anything. No, never said nothing. And incorrect, right? The correct is, I never say, said, sorry, anything, right? That's it, right? Now let's go to this exercise. I consider this topic is not very difficult, so, but even though I will give you three minutes to make it, three minutes, right? Correct the double double negative, right? Three minutes. <coughs> sorry, sorry.
Ready? Number one, please volunteers. Number one. The department doesn't know anything about branding. The department doesn't know anything, right? Yes. Uh, Aminda? Number two? The manager never tell anything. Tell us, tell us. Tell us anything. Okay, that's it. Anything about the plans to improve the brand? Of the bin, right? Good, thank yeah. you. No, number three? That's, oh, wait, what? For Mariano? For Aminda? Yes, number three, please. Volunteers, number three. I, yes, Domingo? I don't, I don't have anything, and, and guys, about about the cruise is the are specific. Very good. Don't have anything again, billboard. You know what is a billboard, right? Yes, you know a billboard. A uh, billboard is the like, uh -huh, las pantallas gigantes que están en la calle, you know. Uh, Camino Santa Tecla, por ejemplo, hay un montón de los dos lados, no. So those are the billboards. And they are very expensive, right? You have to pay like $3,000 every day, you know? Well, anyway, so let's go to number four, please. Volunteer for number four. We didn't get any increase in sales after advertising on Facebook. My goodness. We didn't get any increase, right? Any increase, correct? Nice, nice, thank you very much. And number five, please. Number five, volunteers. The customers don't want any change in price. Any change in prices, perfect, right? Prices. That's it, okay? So to finish the class, we're going to see a video. We finish the, the lesson for today. And for tomorrow, well, we have these last three pages, right? And then we finish the manual. <laughs> Finish the manual, right? For tomorrow. But tonight, I need someone to help me with 10 extra minutes, right? Esta noche voy a tener la última sesión de 10 minutos. Y necesito un voluntario que quiera repetirse, que se quiera reenganchar, right? Ya tuve a Carlita Vanessa, a Mariano. Me, teacher. Ana María, ah. Yes. Me, teacher. Ever, ever, my goodness. I, I can do Thank it. you very yeah. much. You are very kind. Lo vamos a agendar aquí. Let me see. Ever de Jesús Candray. Excuse me, Candray is very right. elegant. Last name, right? Es bien elegante, so pero Gómez is like. <laughs> Gómez. Okay. Now. Thank you, Ever. So don't, don't go, right? Uh, vamos a terminar la clase a las 10 y 3, 4, por ahí más o menos, ¿sí? Uh, porque perdimos unos minutitos por mi culpa, sorry, ya no, por mi internet. Y después me quedo otros 10 minutitos con Ever, right? Ok, so let's go to the video. We're going to see a video, right? And to finish the class. Mm -hmm. Ok. Good, that's it, right? Uh, we were working this with this yesterday. And today we're going to make the second part, right? Solo hicimos la introducción ayer of the video, right? Just give me the second. Yeah. Okay. Here, right? Now it says, uh, he will have some adjective, right? Some adjectives. 
uh, from this box. Listen, amuse, entretenido, right? Amuse, angry, uh, angry, bored, uh, delight, deleitado, placentero, right? This delight, disappointed, molesto, um, uh, desairado, quizás. No, 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 es. Uh, molesto, yeah, disappointed, right? <clears throat> Embarrassed. Con pena, así como se sentó el teacher ahora que lo estaba sacando el internet. <laughs> Embarrassed. Enthusiastic. Excited. Interested. Nervous. Please. Relax. Shy. Calladito, right? Upset. Upset is disappointed, angry, annoyed, right? And worry. Good. Now here we have some situations. He says, you are a dinner guest at someone's house. Your host offers you food you don't like. What is the best thing to do? I think I feel worried. How can I avoid eating it and not offend my, go my host? Lo vamos a hacer un poquitito más grande. Let me see. Es que no, no puedo. Vamos a ver por acá. Ahí creo que sí. Sí, ahí está. Yes, ok, good. So, uh, is it really? I'll be relaxed. Just eat a little bit and say you have a big lunch, right? Ok, good. So, next situation. Your best friend give you a gift that you really don't like. Okay, what of these adjectives can we use to describe what are you going to do if you receive a gift that you don't like? Aminta, can you help me, please? Yes, sure. Okay. Um, I feel very um, embarrassed. Embarrassed. Okay. Embarrassed. Yes. Uh, there is a say that uh, says, don't give the teeth on a gift horse, right? That in Spanish is, a caballo regalado no se le busca lado. <laughs> yes. In English, listen, is, don't see the teeth on a gift horse, right? I will explain okay. it, right? <clears throat> Cuando... Uh, a los caballos se quiere saber si son de calidad, le miran los dientes, ¿sí? Ok, pero si le regalan un caballo, si es de calidad o no, usted agárrelo, el caballo. <laughs> that's, that's the scene, right? So you say, don't see the teeth on a gift horse. Nunca le da los dientes a un caballo que te lo regalen. ¿no? Ok, so in my case, I will say, yes, I don't like it, but <laughs> like I mean, that's say you feel embarrassed, right? Walter, situation number three. Someone forgets an appointment with you, right? You are in Metro Centro waiting for the person. How would you feel? Enthusiastic, nervous, upset. Angry, water. Okay, creo que tuvo problemas con el internet. So, Oscar, can you help me, Oscar? Mm, I feel relaxed. <laughs> oh, God, man. Nice, Oscar. You're really patient, eh? Yeah, what can yes, you do? Whatever. <laughs> Especially if, if it is your wife, right, Oscar? What can you do? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Thank you. It happened to me, you know. I have to wait for my wife for a long time. Okay. Now, you meet someone you like at a party. Ooh, nice. The next day, you run into the person at the supermarket. Se le encontró en selecto, you know? So... How would you feel, uh, Rosibel? Enthusiastic. 
enthusiastic. Nice, Rosie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Very good. Uh, someone talks to you at the store. You realize it's someone you met before, but you can't remember the person's name. Walter, again, please. Se le fue un ratito en internet, ¿verdad, Walter? So, please. Someone talks to you at the store and you realize it's someone you've met before, but you can remember the person's name, right? How will you feel? Um, maybe from second embarrassing. Embarrassed. Okay. Embarrassed. That's it, right now? Embarrassed. Thank you. And Thank you. I am a little bit worried. Worry. Okay. Sorry, sorry. Okay. Now. Okay, we have this. We are going to watch the video for two minutes. Right, and we're going to answer this question. What do you think Tim is doing, right? Trying to make plans, trying to get out of plans, trying to find someone, right? Three options. Again, we watch the video for two minutes and you're going to find out one of these three situations is true, right? So let's watch the video. No se escucha. Es de día. Es de día, right? Sorry. Esa es la idea, sin sonido. <laughs> so, ah, okay. yes. Only watch. Yes. Okay, here we go. That is enough. Now, what do you think Tim is doing? Trying to make plans, trying to get out of plans, or trying to find someone? Try to make plans. Correct, nice. Trying to make plans, that's it, right? Now we're going to watch the video. This time, yes, we're going to watch the video with the sound. We see le vamos a poner sonido, right? And then you're going to check, it says, how do you think these people really feel? Uh, felt, sorry, because it's the past, right? Check the best answer, right? Uh, in the first picture, angry or sympathetic? In the second picture, uh, disappointed or please. In the next picture, uh, 
Definitely or probably not. And in the last four and five, it says, happy to see, but disappointed. Okay. Um, give me a second. Vamos a tener que hacerlo más chiquitito. Sorry. Yes. Creo que por ahí. Vamos a ver. Okay. Now let's watch the video. Let's watch the video. Sorry. Aquí estamos con el video. Hi, Sophia. Hey, Jim. I was thinking about our plans for Saturday. Yeah. You said that you'd make me dinner, and that's going to be great. But I was thinking, could we invite a few more people? You know, since it's my birthday. Oh, well, I already tried that, Tim. Everyone told me they were busy. Really? Well, I think I'll ask a few people again. Maybe they can change their plans. After all, it is my birthday. Hello. Hey, Steve. It's Tim. What's that noise? Oh, sorry. I'm uh, I'm salsa dancing. Really? Yeah, I'm practicing. My mom's coming to town, and she wanted me to take her salsa dancing. Can you believe that? I didn't know you were into salsa dancing. Good for you. Hey, that's not on Saturday night, is it? Oh, that's right. I almost forgot. Uh, Sophia told me that it's your birthday on Saturday. Sorry, I can't be there. That's okay. But have a happy birthday. I'll make it up to you, okay? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Thanks. Uh-huh. Yeah, Jessica, it's going to be fun. Uh-huh. Sophia wanted me to tell you that if Tim calls... Hey, it's Tim on the other line now. Let me get this. Wait! Hi, John. Hey, Tim. Hey, I was wondering, what are you doing Saturday night? Hi, Tim, it's Jessica. Jessica? I thought I called John. You did. Are you guys at John's? Uh, no, we're on a conference call. Oh, Okay. I was wondering. Uh, John isn't available, Tim. Huh? Uh, John um, can't come to your dinner Saturday. Uh, I just asked him. And he told me that he has other plans. I did? Yeah, you just said that you were playing guitar with your band uh, someplace. In fact, I was very surprised that you were playing. Very surprised. Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, I'm busy playing on Saturday. Sorry. But you said you weren't in the band anymore. Uh, this is my farewell concert. I have to do it. I guess you'll miss my birthday. Too bad. Yeah, but I can't get away. You know how it is. Maybe you guys can stop by the club afterward. Sure. Yeah, thanks. That sounds like fun. Cool. Hello? Is anybody home? Who is it? It's Tim. Oh, come on in. Hi, Tim. Glad you can make it. It's my birthday. I wouldn't miss it. Pretzel? Sure. Let's sit. Isn't this wonderful? Hey, how about some TV? I wonder what's on. Live from Cleveland in the hot
Okay, now to finish the class, let's go to this exercise, right? So, picture number one, angry or sympathetic? Angry or sympathetic? Volunteers? Sympathetic, sympathetic right? Okay, next one. Number two, disappointed or please? Disappointed. Disappointed, that's right, nice. And number three, definitely or probably not. Probably not. Probably not, right? Huh? Are you sure? Let me see. Ah, here, right? Sophia, everything under control. Don't worry. What do you think? Give me a second. So I'm gonna make it right. So definitely or probably definitely. not. Definitely. 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 It's like you say, están seguros que van a ser la sorpresa, right? And then number four, happy or confused? Confused. And number four, confused. Happy to confused. see her, but disappointed that no one else mm. could come. Happy to see her. Happy, right? Happy to see Sophia, mm. but but disappointed. Disappointed for nobody. Okay, good. Mm. And number five. Angry or delighted? Delighted. delighted. delighted, right? Okay, thank you. I already take the, it took the, the attendance, so don't worry. Uh, sorry again. Perdón por hacerlos uh, quedarse un poquitito más tarde, please. So uh, I have the attendance now, right? Ya tomé la asistencia. So have a good night and repeat, I repeat. Time. Please do not miss the class tomorrow. Por favor, no se vayan a perder la clase mañana. En la última clase, y además vamos a hacer la encuesta, ¿sí? ¿Qué le hacemos al que falte? Eh? Le vamos a poner a ver un partido del Real Madrid para que se burra. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Okay, see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Sí. Except ever, please. See you. See you. See you. Got Bye, teacher. See you. Good, Good night. night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. Good night, class. Bye, teacher. Bye, 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 bye. bye. God bless you. Good night, teacher. Good night, Vanessa. God bless you. Bye. Okay, good night, teacher. Hi. Uh, do you want to discuss a specific topic? Because I have a topic for you tonight. The present. Okay, part. only. Hmm? Only I start with the topic. Uh, I just. Uh, when I hear about the explication of the nothing and anything, because I can be in the in the class, the pure practice uh, class. Don't worry, I will explain. My goodness, I will, I will, I will explain. I will explain. No problem. Make, make two, two. Man. Thank you. No problem ever. That's I am here to help you. Yes. So. This, the thing is this, right, uh, Ever? that, look, double negative is when in only one sentence, in one sentence, in the same sentence, you have two expressions that indicate that something is negative, right? Here we have the example that I show you in the presentation. It says, uh, I don't, wait, let me move this here, right? I don't, negative. No, nothing. Uh, this is the same ever that in all the sentences in English, this is very common. Let me share, let me share something else with you, right? I will share okay. the, the word power, the power, say the, the word document. The present, document. Or the presentation, the PowerPoint, no. No, 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 no. Yeah, wait, I will show you. I will show you this. Yes. Okay. Here. Okay, Evan. So when you are using the simple present, Evan, you say, for example, she, she 
das doesn't speak English, right? But you say, ah, she is third person singular. So you add an S, right? But this okay. is not correct. Why is not correct? Because in English, the same sentence ha cannot have two structures together, right? Here, for example, I have doesn't and I have the S here, right? So it's not necessary. I'm sorry, it's not necessary to copy the S, right? So the same happened here, right? Look, ever didn't, uh, didn't eat, sorry, didn't eat uh, hamburgers. Hamburgers yesterday. Okay, why do you, you don't say eight? Why not? Because you already used didn't, right? So again, you cannot use two structures together, right? Like this. And, and put the verb, the verb in base, yes. Correct, so it's not possible. So in this case, you have to use it, right? Because right. the general rule ever is that in one sentence, you cannot use two structures at the same time. You only need one. In okay. the simple present, doesn't is only necessary because you show that this simple present, or in this se second sentence, didn't, you indicate that already the sentence is in the simple past and you don't need to change the verb, right? The same happened okay. with the double negative. Look, I don't know nothing so nothing is negative and don't is negative so no no you cannot do that you have to say i don't know any anything right okay this is the correct expression because anything is positive and don't is negative so we have concordance right yeah okay now let's go to the to the manual again and let's see the example, right? Let's see the examples. We don't publish nothing. Don't negative and nothing negative. Uh-uh, and impossible. You cannot do that, either, right? The double negative is not good, is incorrect. Let's see nothing here, okay. didn't. I mean, wait, wait a minute. Didn't, oh, sorry, no, it's a kid, it's a kid. Uh, sorry, it's good. Okay, didn't, the company didn't get no, didn't and no, two negatives again, right? Didn't get any, so the correct here is any, right? So is not only in two negatives ever, but in simple present, simple past, Etc. Etc. You cannot have two structures in the same sentence because. Yes, I got it. Clear, clear. Good. Okay. In, in this case, for the second sentence, um, the, the the word no, we uh, should is negative. Uh, is negative. Mm -hmm. And we are going to uh, substitute. Not substitute for any. For any. Substitute for, uh, for any. Okay. Totally right. Okay, I got it. I got it. You got it? Okay, so before uh, we finish, I have some questions for you. Let me see. Uh, let me open the, the file, right? Let me open okay. the file. And here, uh, discussion topics. I have many discussion topics, eh? <laughs> uh, did you like the topic of today? I know. Ever? I know you were not right? I can read it, yes, I can read it. Oh, good, please. Uh, uh, the topic is annoying things. Annoying, annoying things, okay. Cosas que me molestan, right? Annoying things. It was interesting. 
but sadly yes. you're you're coming late for the class because of your work right so sorry because ever you are one yes. of the students that like to participate all the time in the class and i like that but well, sadly you cannot do it right now right okay ever let me share this with you Good. Uh, have you ever been in a fist fight ever? Fist fight? In a fist, fist. fist fight, have you been the fist, the, uh, the meaning? Fist, my fist. Ah. Ah, yes, yes. Yes. <laughs> You're, I, you, <laughs> you are playing this. And sometimes okay, sometime lose. Uh, so, um, sometime of course. <laughs> me too. My, me too. My, my wife said that I'm very playing so you know. Okay. Have you ever been on TV? Yeah, I, Have you ever been on TV? I never been in TV. Oh. Eh, even ni en, do, ni en domingo para todos. <laughs> even even uh, I even infantil, I, I, I never been on TV. Okay. We have this question, right? Have you ever driven a sport car? A sports car? No teacher. Never. I didn't. A truck? I stuff for it, but I like it. A truck in one opportunity, yes. Oh, okay. It yes. was a big truck? And one, and one bus, too. And one bus. One bus! A big My truck. Goodness. And it, bus, too. And it was really hard. Yes. Uh, the truck has, uh, is the is different to the to the changes on the on the oh, yes we have to make many changes the, i heard they they have 16 16 shift is different no no it's not true all is so no is the the truck when i can you can drive what the was the 10 tons 10 10 and that's it is um, Okay. A big cabin and okay. Now next one. Look, have you ever eaten frog legs? Okay. Have you ever frog eaten legs. frog legs? Anca de rana? No. Never. No. No teacher. Horse meat. And and and, uh, and I like horse <laughs> meat. I don't know. Yeah. Sometimes the market. <laughs> you don't know, and, right? And the, and the market sometimes. Like, yes. This, Maybe uh, in the market, right? Uh, uh, one that is is very, very. Yeah, and in Cuscatlan Stadium too, right? In Cuscatlan Stadium, ever? Are you free? Are you, are you free? Are your face in the future? I can I can hang it. I can stop. Okay. Uh, the internet is going please? down. The internet is going down. The last question. The last yeah. question, ever, and we finish. Don't worry. It's a little. Okay. Have you ever had a deja vu experience? Yes, yes yes what was i got a, I, I got a, a different and uh, the more nearly i i can and sometimes i live when i can walk to the street and uh -huh. i found uh a one issues in the in the broad and De repente, oh, quickly, suddenly, no. suddenly, 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 I got that uh, one down, a uh, one, oh, uh, and and when I, I when I, how to say, 
caída. A fall, a fall, a fall. A fall, yes. A fall. And yes, yes. Nice. It's very strange, right? Our mind plays games with you, right? You think, si eso ya lo viví. What happened? Okay. Es cierto. Es cierto. It's very common. It's very common. Yes. Hey, Ever, thank you to stay with me. Very common. Yeah. I hope to see you tomorrow. No pleasure, teacher. So that it was a promise I I, I give you on the Friday. I know. No? I remember. remember. Yeah, I remember. I, you said I that, can right? stay. I can I can stay yesterday, but I I am here. Yeah, that's nice. Thank you, Ever. Teacher, one thing in Spanish. Mm -hmm. uh, El link que le dijo eh, que iba a compartir, no sé si me lo pudiese mandar a mí, que donde pudiésemos encontrar este, diferentes situaciones que se puede desarrollar el listening, puede ah, ser, ver videos. Sí. Ajá, no sé si se recuerda. Lo voy a mandar al grupo ahorita. Ahorita lo mando antes que se me olvide, sí. Sí, es cierto. Yo Perfecto, sí. Sí, perdón. Entonces voy a, voy a hacer igual que Ever. Tengo que tener palabra. <laughs> eso, eso. Okay. Muchas gracias, teacher. Okay, have a good night. Good and blessing, right? Thank you. Bye.